Gente, começando mais um vídeo de Tales of Chilia, voltamos para Charilton. I saw the young madam to her chambers. She is utterly exhausted. What do you expect? As if being captured by goons and tossed into prison wasn't exhausting enough. She learned her brother died too. She apparently heard of Klein's fate when she was taken. She is surprisingly calm given the circumstances. Jude, how's Mila? She was fortunate to have someone with medical expertise nearby. And your healing arts were a real boon. They helped stop the hemorrhaging. She has lost a great deal of strength, however. These next few hours will be crucial. Please, get some rest, everyone. I'll take good care of her. Shouldn't you rest as well, Doctor? You've been using spirit arts all day. You must be exhausted. Now hold on a second. I can say the same of you. The young man can handle this. Please, Doctor, this way. Is everything going to be okay? Mila's gonna die? She'll pull through. I know she will. You all should get some rest, too. I want to help, too. If it's okay with you. Thank you. This isn't my specialty, so I'm gonna turn in. Okay. what they're talking about. It would seem the worst is over. Yes, she's breathing normally again. I think she'll be okay. Now it's your turn to get some rest. Just as soon as I tell Elise and Alvin. Oh, there you are. Now we can thank Mila for the jailbreak! Yes. Where's Alvin? I'm not really sure, now that you mention it. I'll go find him. Se encontrar com a Alvin, eu aposto, mano, não é spoiler. Eu tô achando que ele tá recebendo outro ponto com ele. Praça Central de Charilton. Vamos aqui é. Aqui é o Thales.
Alvin, good news. I know. She's out of the woods, right? Uh, yeah. How'd you know? It's written all over your face. Hey, have you ever heard what folks call this city? No, not really. The city of hails and farewells. It's a waypoint for travelers. They stock up on supplies here before heading out. And people returning from a journey unload the surplus goods here. I couldn't have picked a better place. What do you mean? That woman I was chatting with. She's my new employer. Huh? You're bailing on us? Why risk my life to accomplish someone else's suicide run? That's no way for a mercenary to make a living. Mila's just trying to complete her mission. What about my mission? Any idea what it might be? What? How should I know? I don't know either. Does anybody? How many people do you know have a mission in life? One they're willing to risk their lives for? <sighs> What's your mission, kid? I just want to help Mila. That's all. Fine. Nothing wrong with that. You could help her too. I'll swing by to say goodbye before you all leave. City of hails and farewells, huh? Mano, eu acho que significa casa do prefeito. Eu acho, não sei. Casa da pessoa que re... Eu não sei, eu não sei. Vai ter conversa, pera aí. Before a window is open. That means Mila's awake. Yeah. What's wrong? There's something I should tell you. It can't be. Your legs. Yes. No tingling, no pain, no anything. Ela tá paraplégica, putz grila, mano. Jude, where's my sword? Don't be ridiculous. You have to rest. I have rested long enough. I must get to Fenmont. You're still going on about your mission? That's all over now. Don't you get it? What gives you the right to make that decision? Decision? Don't be stubborn. There is no choice here. You don't have any strength left. You can't even walk, let alone wield a sword. You have to accept reality. Jude, do you remember the people of Hamil? Huh? They were forced into a situation they didn't choose, and they didn't have the strength to fight against it. Well, yeah, maybe things would have turned out differently for them if they were stronger. So what is strength exactly? Is it something you wield to fend off attackers? Is it something you use to control the four great spirits? Is it something that lets you walk on your own two legs? It's none of those things. Not real strength. You just won't give up, will you? I can't give up. My mission won't let me. I must keep moving forward. Even if your body won't move at all? That's who I am.
Oh, good morning. Is something on your mind? It's just that a long time ago, my father healed a patient who had lost the use of his legs. Really? Yes, really. So I was thinking we could visit my hometown, La Ronde. What changed? You were so determined to hold me back yesterday. I was... I don't know why. I'm not sure what changed. Huh. If you say so. I just know there's nothing I can do to stop you. Even if you can't walk, you'll just crawl away and get into trouble. <laughs> you really are... A do-gooder? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. I'm in your hands. Right. We can reach Laurent by boat, so let's head to Sapstrath Sea Haven. Ah, you have my gratitude. And you have my hopes for a full recovery. Please take the utmost caution on your journey. I'm truly sorry we cannot accompany you. No need to apologize. You have much to keep you occupied here. Drissel's life is about to get very busy. She'll need your guidance. Yes. You're really leaving? Yeah. Take care, okay? You don't have to worry about being lonely anymore. Drissel and Rowan will keep you company. I know, but still... We should get moving. Everyone, you've been a great help. I'm in your debt. Time to hit the road. Thanks, all of you. Super Pals, don't split up! We stay together forever! I hope we get to see them soon. So, we're really continuing on. So be it. I it's I aren't you? my I've read ah ex It's about to pour down on us. Better call it a day. Good idea. How did you become such an amazing cook? I can't even boil water without burning it. That's not true. Anybody can become a good cook with practice. Everyone has their own mission. <laughs> so you're saying my mission is to cook for Mila Maxwell? Well, in my current state, I can't even do that. I can't make dinner. I can't even make a bed anymore. Don't worry. I'll do that stuff for you from now on. <laughs> hey. Sit closer. Dá um beijo nela, cara. Ela tá te querendo. I want to thank you. Please, take this as a token of my appreciation. Thanks. Era pra ter rolado um love aí, né, gente? Ela tá demonstrando que quer ele. Por 
que quem tem que dar em cima da mulher ou a mulher do homem é que parte do homem, não é da mulher. A mulher no máximo pode dar um mole. E o homem tem que pedir pedir namoro, etc. Glad to hear it. A iniciativa tem que ser do homem, né? O máximo que a mulher pode fazer é dar a entender que quer o cara, né? Um monstro ali, é. Troféu 3.200. Dá pausa aqui. Vamos lá. Troféu 3.200, gente. Vamos ver aqui. Troféu 3.200 Demorando Troféus 3.300 3.300 troféus 3.300 troféus 9 platinas 666 ouro 604 prata 2.500 em bronze Eu não sou um caçador legítimo de troféus gente. Eu só, como eu tenho o YouTube eu procuro só jogando e pegando os troféus que eu vou indo pela frente, o que dá. O que não dá eu deixo para trás. No passado eu, eu me dedicava aos troféus, mas agora não me dedico muito não. Mas de qualquer forma eu faço questão de registrar minhas conquistas. Bom gente, para vocês verem o restante dos troféus, que tem troféu do Playstation 4, fiquem agora com o Playstation 4 e já já eu volto para o... Playstation 3 aqui com o Celi. Então fiquem com o Playstation 4 Bom gente, como vocês viram aí Eu consegui a conquista 3300 No Tales of Chilia Vamos conferir agora todo o meu histórico de conquista Vocês veem ali que no Tales of Chilia tem muito pouco troféu Devido a muita pouca dedicação Verdade seja dita, desde que porque na época que eu joguei o Chile com a Mila, inclusive está gravado todo o gameplay lá nas primeiras playlists, eu fui jogar para finalizar o mais rápido possível. Aí peguei um pouco de troféu com ela, agora estou jogando com o com Dude, ó, com o Jude, e estou pegando também pouco de troféu também. Bom, gente, é o seguinte: eu peguei aqui o troféu, né? 3.300, Tales of Chilia. Os últimos foram do Resident Evil. Aí um bocado de troféu. Crash Bandicoot 3, um bocado de troféu. Kingdom Hearts, Shine of Memories. Eu não sei jogar esse jogo. Quatro, nem se eu continuar ele. Quatro troféus. Dead Rising, um troféu. Que eu não... Eu, não vou, eu deletei o arquivo, depois eu joguei de novo. Aí depois eu parei. Bom... 
Não, só um troféu só, né? Ainda, ainda não finalizei. Resident Evil 7, 25 troféus. Vamos abaixar mais agora os poucos aqui. Esse Green Fandang aqui também, se você não platinar, pelo amor de Deus. Resident Evil 0, Fórmula 1, Crash. Esse jogo em japonês é o I.M. Setsuna, que eu recomendo muito. Bloodborne, jogaço, difícil, mas jogaço. Tales of Zestiria, primeiro Tales of em português. Peguei nele 16 troféus. Descendo, um descendo. Nino Kuhn, que eu joguei recentemente. Vocês estão vendo aí, né, os jogos? Tô passando bem devagarzinho, qualquer coisa, você pausa. Gran Turismo, eu amo total esse jogo. Pena que a Frank Sol comparece que acabou, né, sou muito fã dela. Eu ainda tenho a versão original do Só com 2 aqui. Foi o único que eu joguei da franquia além do Só com 4. Só com 2 e Só com 4. Eles não tinham 5 jogaços. Grila. Metal Gear Solid 3 jogaço. Medal of Honor Frontline. Putz, grila, gente. Isso é um baita do jogo. PS 2010 já alugado na época. Eu aluguei esse jogo aqui. Pronto, acabou. Vamos subir agora um pouco mais rápido. Qualquer coisa você pausa. Caso que ele confira alguns troféus. Pronto, gente, é isso aí, 3.300 troféus. Agora vamos continuar com o Tales of Celia. I'm fine. Vamos lá, agora que você viu o Playstation 4, vamos continuar aqui. Hey! 
way. Hold tight. Are your legs okay? If they start to hurt, just say so. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> How very odd. When you carry me on your back like this, I can't help but remember flying with Syl. Fighting a lot. I hit it. What? The, the battle. I. <laughs> Nothing. Let me go check on the ship's schedule. I'll be right back. Lady Mila! I finally caught up with you! Ivor, what are you doing here? When I saw your face on the Wanted posters, I knew I just had to find you right away. But what about your duty to protect Nia Kara? I begged the villagers to let me come to your aid. They were very understanding. You imbecile. That's not the point. Don't you realize- Ugh. Lady Mila, are you okay? Your... your legs. Mila! You! Tell me what you've done to her! Stand down, Ivor. This wasn't Jude's fault. I brought this upon myself. But you wouldn't be in this predicament if I'd been by your side. Listen here, Pipsqueak. Handmaids are made, not appointed. One must dedicate his life to serving and protecting Lady Mila. It is an esteemed position for real men. Manly men! She may have commanded it, but clearly it was a mistake to let an uncouth, unreliable, underhanded stranger like you serve her holy person. Now, come with me, Lady Mila. Wait! My father might be able to heal her legs. If what you say is true... I will be the one to take her to see him. I've had you pegged as a phony from the moment I laid eyes on you. Now know your place and be gone! You can accompany her if you like, but I'm coming too. Hmm. Ivor, stop this nonsense. Please, Lady Mila, stay where you are. You will thank me for this later. How dare you allow this to happen? I... Shut up! I don't need to hear your excuses. I tried. I said shut up! It's time for you to pay for your sins, you bastard! I must have done my duties. Level up. Pretty good for a phony. Call me whatever you want. I just want to help Mila. How many times do I have to tell you? That's my job. Wait, Mila. I don't have time for this. You two can duke it out as much as you want. I'm leaving. I'm sorry. If you still aren't satisfied, I'll fight you again later. Right now we need to get moving. <laughs> Ivor, I have something very important to give you. It's crucial that no one else gets their hands on it. Consider it as precious as my life. The lives of the four are counting on it. And you're entrusting it to me? I shall defend it to my last breath, Lady Mila. I knew I can count on my handmaid. Now, return to Nia Kara. What? Your duty is to protect Nia Kara. But Lady Mila, my place is with you! Don't make me repeat myself. 
G hurry up and take her. But don't forget who's the real handmaid. This guy. Uh, sure thing. And I promise, I won't rest until Mila walks again. You got that right. Salvo aqui. Gente, eu quero agradecer e obrigado por assistir. Deixe o um comentário, like, sininho. Um abraço aos cavaleiros, um beijo às damas. Fiquem com Deus e até o próximo vídeo. Vamos lá para o Leirão. Uh...